We are not reporters nor journalists. The views, information, or opinions expressed are strictly and solely barber shop talk. We pride ourselves on being uncut, unapologetic, uncompromising, unfiltered, and refuse to conform to anything less than. So if you can't, cut the cap. This ain't the show for you. So Drake dropped a second diss track. The best rapper in the world, OVO Gang. Okay, keep that same energy. Know what I'm saying? Please re re remain there. Know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, so Drake dropped a second diss record. Know what I mean? Aimed at Kendrick. Um, now, on this one, know what I mean? He decided to uh, enlist the the help of others. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> others being uh, the late great Tupac Shakur, <laughs> right? I know great some funny guy. Funny guy. You know what I'm saying how the fuck he do that? You feel me, right? He's a very funny guy, man. You know, and uh, now I mean the legendary Snoop Dogg. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so I want to get y'all take on this, man. What y'all, what's y'all thoughts on the diss record? What's y'all thoughts on the, you know, the, the I, I mean, what you want to call it? I don't, what, man, go ahead. What's y'all thoughts on the diss record, man? You know what <laughs> He's a mom. He's out here trolling at this point. Well, he's just he's trolling at this point. Um <laughs> he's just trying to get Kendrick to say something. Like, and I at the, I don't think Kendrick's gonna say something. Like I thinking about how Kendrick moves. I think Kendrick he'll wait later on when he got something going on with music, or he drop another verse or something like that somewhere, and he'll say something. But at this point, I don't even think Kendrick is actually going to get in the booth and say something. So it's just kind of a, a, a default to, to Drake right now out of the big three just because of Kendrick ain't saying nothing. The best rapper. That's kind of trash. Okay. Bash, what you thought about? I, uh, uh, Kendrick will definitely say something. Uh, I seen that uh, his uh, top top uh, TDE said he did a, he quoted a Machiavelli uh, Machiavelli rap, which is like, uh, "What's the joint? Um, Holy Quran, let's get hooked like it's five oh my forty five next to me when we fight for survivor." Mm -hmm. So something is coming, you know what I mean? I know it ain't just gonna you know, be quoted, cool but ain't nobody further. I ain't gonna lie, Drake Drake got it right now. I, Man, Drake, Drake, Drake whooping butt, bro. Drake, oh, so I ain't gonna like lie. That. You like what he did. Right I think, you know what, listen, from a, from, now you troll. After you sing your diss record, no need to waste more ammunition. Because you know if he does come back, he'll come back with something crazy. So now you troll. Now he getting the troll babies involved. And once the troll, it was hilarious because he let, he let uh, Snoop go. He said, I'll take it from here on. <laughs> then he start rapping. I thought that was just was hilarious. <laughs> That gravy, your name, and some hip hop history. And you deal with this viciously. You seem a little nervous about all the publicity. For this Canadian lights. Look, that's cool, but this Snoop one is funny too. He's like, yo, you gotta represent for the West. You know, right, right, Snoop, right. Snoop was going there, but we know that was Drake, man. But I think it was clever. I think it was real trolly, man. I enjoyed it, man. I, I enjoyed it. Okay. Right. I thought that shit was trash. Was trash. Know what I'm saying, <laughs> but um, but you know it's wild though. I thought you know I thought the gimmicky part to right. me was trash. Know what I'm saying I ain't like that. But uh, and you know it's it <clears throat> wild for me. Know what I mean I'm gonna keep it tall for me. Hearing that one, I think I I, I preferred him rapping on that one more than the first one that he did. You know what I'm saying? Like, the verse that he did yeah. on that one, to me, I preferred it better than the first joint he did. I just felt like that, you know, he was more direct. 
he was more disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? I'm with the disrespect shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I ain't even going to cap. When it comes to battle, you know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas going at each other. You know what I mean? Ain't no rules in war. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. You, you got the... Y'all niggas ain't taking it to the streets, clearly. You know what I'm saying? We know this. You know, we, and we not calling for that neither. You know, let's keep it on wax. Yeah. But let's go to war. You know what I'm saying? That little first shit to me was... Which is why I said I ain't like it. It was trash to me. Cause he talk about the same shit that Drake talk about all the time. I don't want to hear about the motherfucking how much money you got and how big your house. I ain't trying, my nigga. I don't give a fuck about all that shit. Right? Yeah, that's that's the who's the who's thing is bigger. Nobody cares about that. Right. We don't you know see the saying? bars, bro. So when that shiny joint was a size seven shoe, though, that that was funny. <laughs> I'm like, why funny, keep man. bringing up his shoes? Because he, he's, he, he's making it seem like he's a little kid, like he's a little dude. Yeah. <laughs> that was in the funny. second joint, though. I feel like he was more on some just rapping shit. Yeah, he was. You feel me? Like he was just rapping, and rapping. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Absolutely. Yo, but he he did say yeah. one thing that kind of yo, and I I. Every time Taylor Swift about to drop, it get ghost. I don't know whether he playing off of a label standpoint because other labels is like, yo, we can't really compete with that. Yeah. Let's just fall back and wait. But I mean, God leash, bro. Drake is making everybody in the industry seem like you guys are puppets. Like you guys are scared to drop your music. Except for, you know, we, we're not going to crew Yeezy. You know, he, he going to do what he do. You know what I mean? He don't care who it is, what it is. He go. But other than that, I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's, it's the money that they got to spend to promote the record that they like, yo, don't even combat that. Let's just fall back and wait. But it's, it was quiet storm, man. I was looking. I'm looking for music. I'm looking for reactions. I'm looking for things. And I'm like, yo, ain't nobody out. And I see Taylor Swift. And I'm like, oh, okay. Right, right. Yeah, Every right. year she do this. Every time. Yeah, she's well, listen, the runoff. The runoff son that you just said, nah, I mean, you brought up Ye, so Ye jumped in the joint. Nah, I mean, Ye got involved with it too, man. <laughs> nah, I mean, he he went and did his own remix <laughs> to like that, but he was, nah, I mean, sending some uh, shots at Drake, man. Shouts out to Ye. <laughs> shouts out to Ye. What, what you Yo. thought about that one? Huh? I thought what they fixed the debut, but shouts out to him. How, how Ye being more hip hop than Cole? This is tough. They, they ain't fixed nothing, yo. It's crazy, fine. Cause, but the only thing is, yo, Ye got to shut up because, yo, what are you talking about? You took a whole rap song from Drake, bro. Like, you literally took a song from Drake, bro. Like, it's over, bro. I ain't going front though. <laughs> I'm trying to find that kind. Of, yeah, it look like he got to take it down everywhere. <laughs> yeah, Dr Dribble said Drake oh, on music. Dude. One once you put out a rap, once somebody gives you a rap, you can't diss them ever again. If you say they blind or you say they hooked, nah, that's not over. True. You cannot not diss true. the guy who gave you a hit record. You can't, bro. You, <laughs> that's you got not this, true. Yo, you cannot do that, bro. That Drake, is it. Nick, is that include that excludes half the people Drake is beefing with them? No, he never gave Rick Ross a line. He never gave him a line. Nah, but sing. you said a hit record, though. No, no, I'm talking about like look, like if I write you a song, you know what I mean? Or I, I send you a song your way, not a hook to okay. where you know he's saying a hook. Like he literally took bars from Drake. Like Drake sent. Him oh, a song. so then Drake can't battle a lot of people then. Who? What do you mean? <laughs> All his ghostwriters. <laughs> they ain't saying nothing. Quinn Miller, he finished. Like they, they. No, remember Quinn Miller came at him too. Quinn <laughs> Miller can't. Bro, he's not gonna beat him though, bro. Cool. Yeah, like, but but I mean, over yeah bro. Right. Quinn Miller, <laughs> Ghost Rider thing. To argue. He wasn't supposed to battle Quinn Miller. He went at. He Quentin never Miller. did he finish him. Nah, he, he was he he definitely finished. Quentin he Miller. came at Meek. Meek went to Quinn Miller and got the the sauce, and then and, you know what and I mean. Miller Miller said what he said, and he disappeared. And what happened to both of them? <laughs> now they both talking about yo Drake, you the man, bro. We love you, bro. I don't know about that, but okay. That's the AB could definitely talk about Drake as the man, bro. Okay, he just, he got a lot of other shit to worry about. He ain't with no problems. He don't. He, yeah, he definitely don't, bro. <laughs> he don't with no problems. Nah, yeah, but he really took that Kanye kind of reverse off everything, bro. But Yeezy tripping on that one. I don't agree with Yeezy. That's just my. Opinion. I I listen, man. I didn't even get the chance to hear it. That's the crazy part. I heard that he was out, but I didn't get to hear it. The stuff, hear it. yo, the stuff he was saying about Drake. 
It's disgusting. <laughs> he was going. He was Yo, it is disgusting. I, I, you know what? I don't have that on Cap and Oak so I'm glad we are. Shout out to you, Wolf. Yo, mm-hmm. bro, he is literally. Actually, I think I do have. I uh, no, no, I don't. Even if I did, we talking about it. Yo, yo, bro, he talking about Drake and what, oh, who's behind him. You can right. pull it up if you want. Oh, I did. Treat a bad bitch like she average. I treat a bad bitch like a bad bitch. And they never let me get money again. On my cat wings when they get funny again. Yeah, you see, they tried to count me out. I like that. We just hit a number one. We right back. 500 down on the bottom. 500 up at the top. Titanium grills. Call that smile on the rocks. I done had everything that you're able to get. I ain't been in drill too. I ain't gonna lie, it was chopped. Hey, another one, volume one. Then it's two and three. Vultures on repeat. Still feel like Pablo, drug dealer chic. Pluto sent the drones and hit like Metro Beats. It's a rap for niggas. Where's Lucien? Serve your master, nigga. You caught a little bag for your masters, didn't you? Lifetime deal, like a bad for niggas. Bad for niggas. Y'all so out of sight, out of mind. Get I can't even think here, of a Drake this line. Is Play Jake this Cole, is the, the worst one out of all of them, bro. Play this shit back 130 times. That joint is... And I don't know why he did that to that joint, bro. He was once a... Stop that joint. Uh, was I? I joined with I, trash, yo, but I, bro. I heard mad of those lines like elsewhere, like outside of this, like scattered. Like I heard, yeah, it was all over. <laughs> you the need place. to hit the caca doodle pp on that one, bro. I joined with doodle, bro. Ain't no way, bro. Um, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. Yo, and then on top of that, bro, he yo he making it hot because I hope Metro Boom and all of them ride with him. He in there talking about yeah, we was in Paris teamed up because it's time to eliminate drake i'm like yo you are bucket bro hold on like, he said that yo, he definitely nah, that's, that's, that's not that's not <laughs> but that's not like real kanye that's not like something he would say yeah, nice. that's not like he's something he would say it's time to eliminate i'm like yo y'all yo you yo bro you, yo get listen off that i just game, need bro. him to make music because he's he all, <laughs> listen I'm tired of def- like hold up. I'm tired of defending him, right? Because he just had an interview that I watched, right? I don't know who the guy was, but he had an interview, and this man was calling Kai Sinet an industry plant. That's another thing. In the, in the same interview, he said all of that, bro. He bro, sat on that couch like, and would just run his mouth, bro. Bro, I was like, what the? F- what is going on here? Like, I don't know. He, yeah, but Kanye. That, listen, I'm musically I fucks with Kanye, but. Uh, not after he you heard him, that man. musically, he sound that was doo doo. He said, it, "I mean, the doo doo part is it was supposed to be a diss. If it was a verse, it would have been a, it would have been a normal, uh, you know, it would have been a Kanye verse. But just the fact that he going at Drake and inserted Kanye himself West has makes lost kind of reality, bro. He has lost sense of reality. Ain't no way. After you saying he called him an industry plant, Kai, we yeah. every, the world got to watch Kai come up from the bottom." Yep. The, the, if it, he's the less that's running ever around call, the house right, and everything you cannot call someone like that an industry plan without looking at yourself and saying yo i'm disconnected my bad y'all how did i you you sound it, really it, foolish right there like i'm talking about kanye the, yeah the, the fucked up part about it is it was based upon how his reaction to kanye's clothes right which again i still didn't get my damn boots i just it's been two and a half months now almost three months and i finally got an email talking about we working hard to, to ship your shits out and it's going on three months but anyway it was a reaction to <laughs> I, i'm not getting into it fuck that but he wild anyway yeah bro he is disconnected bro he yeah. kind of, in that interview a show bro he's disconnected yeah he has a purpose and a point you know i get what he we all get what he's trying to you know what i mean but I, we don't get it no more you're going too far bro you lost everybody bro you're losing everybody the vultures, it don't take 20 people to do Drake. You making them sound like they saw, bro. I know they not vouching for that, bro. They not riding with that, bro. Ain't no way, bro. 
Nah, but he really said that, though. He really, yo, pull it up. I said, yo, this guy is crazy, bro. Like, yo, ain't no he way, said bro. To eliminate, he, said he said to, to eliminate. eliminate. It's time to eliminate Drake. <laughs> so we took nah. a trip to Paris. We all got together. And we, I'm like, what is going on yo, here, bro? Ain't no way, bro. It's future vouching for this, bro. <laughs> ain't no way. Not my dog. Not my dog, see. future, Metro I Bowl. I know. I ain't see that, Joe. That, ain't nobody backing that, bro. He's sitting there by himself. He's just rambling. They go. They they not gonna say nothing, bro. He spent thirty minutes dissing Drake. <laughs> yo, and did he? Matter of fact, yo, listen. He said more, but I don't know which one I had on cap and no cap. But I don't even care. Yo, he said that. Yo, he yo he like yo. He got a rich baby daddy on 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 the record label that backs him. The owner of Universe. I'm like, yo, bro, you are just obsessed with drake bro you got an issue with drake oh he was saying that about drake. i think he got an Yo. issue with anybody who's at the top of the game at the current time he's like that's your baby daddy that's why he said that in the line in the <laughs> song and it's like yo bro that's they know yo, you are disconnected bro like <laughs> Yo, I do you think he got like a complex about like anybody that's up top on the game he comes at because he was doing this to hope at one point now you're on drake he, he couldn't Plus, win hope so he gave up i ain't gonna yeah. lie there I think he might be right. <laughs> yo, he made Drake seem like Thanos, though. I'm like, yo, ain't no way you giving yeah, this man thing. this much power, bro. We came together. We had to put all our rings together and for Captain Planet to take Drake out. Like, what? <laughs> what yeah, is going on here, yeah, bro? She said, well, I ain't gonna get I I ain't see that joint. I ain't know all that. Pull that up, people please. People actually bro. like. I got the interview, but I don't want to play it because it's on it's a YouTube. Oh it's yeah, yeah, don't do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but people, people are agreeing with it. Yeah, no, people, people are not with agreeing it. with it. Yo, bro, no, people, no bro. there's people that don't, but there's some people that actually agree with it. And, that, and when I don't agree with it, I be like, yo, ain't nobody agreeing with this shit. Cause I fuck. Nah, with you got to remember, bro, there's, there's people, a lot of bots going on, bro. They ain't got yeah, bots. Okay. A lot of yeah, bro. People are not, and you know, there are people. No, you're right. Not to interrupt you. I'm sorry. Hey, what you were saying? No, I'm sorry. No, no, you got to kind of work. Uh, yeah, you, you're you right. There are some people that's lost like him. That's just like, yo, listen, there's another person that was disconnected. He seems to be trying to get himself back. Eminem. He was very disconnected. Yay, yeah, yeah, you're disconnected too, bro. Telling people they industry plants. That we know that's from the bottom. I don't care if one person in that section agree with you. They're wrong too. They are dead wrong. Like, yo, we watch Kai every single night, bro. He's off, bro. He's off his rocket, bro. Yo, why is the title of this? Kanye says, Future called him to eliminate Drake. Says, J. Cole's music turns women off. <laughs> oh, no. He said that? J. Cole said, I didn't even hear that part. This man is off his rocket, bro. But then again, it could be just for clicks, bro. He could Kanye West could just be doing that dream for clicks, bro. He probably don't even care, bro. I just don't know. He said, hold on. You said he said what for? He said that future called him to eliminate Drake and that J. Cole's music turns women off. (laughs) Yo, it's yo, what he yo, bro, that dude is yeah, man. That's that's he down bad, bro. He down bad, bro. That's tough. I, to... <laughs> I don't care how many shoes he sell. How whatever he down bad, bro. Yeah, that's wild. I ain't, I ain't see. I ain't see that interview. I, ain't... I wish I you could pull he... it up the video, but, but he can't. Yeah, we don't want to get in. Uh... Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, that would be a segment ass. we would have to. Uh... We would have just have that Drake separate. has everyone excited and energized. Wow. Yo, Wolf, you should have heard it. If you heard him say that, you'd have been like, what the? Yo, he sat on that couch and said that, bro. <laughs> we all got together. For one person. All right, man. Nah, man uh, yo, and just to nah, man, uh, backtrack oh, as far as Kendrick. Listen, I think Kendrick, uh, it, I definitely think Kendrick going to drop something. I'm saying, but I think you know Kendrick being Kendrick, he move on his own accord. 
No, I'm sure. That's what I said. I'm, that's what I said. If he do drop no, some, he definitely be drop some. If he drops some, but especially he with be... Drake, no, he's gonna drop some. You know what I'm saying? Okay. There's no way that he's not gonna drop some. He gonna drop some. But all that, know what I mean, Drake doing, yeah, drop, drop, hurry up and drop, like. Knowing how Kendrick moves, nigga, that nigga look probably like, man, I'm going yeah. to my sweet old time with this shit. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? I drop whenever the fuck I want to drop type shit. Right. Exactly. I hate these other little niggas. That's a fact. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't going to control my narrative, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Said, I don't Drake need the click the nigga. likes. I, I, Kendrick the type of nigga that drop, he can come back and drop his shit with niggas is like, all right, fuck this shit. This shit's old. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> He don't care about clicks and likes. He don't care about right. that. That's a fact. Nah, I mean, nah, kid is the type of nigga, like, as soon as he got a project coming out, he just... <laughs> yeah, but, but he don't care about, like, the baby said something earlier, like, well, dang. Uh, yeah, the baby said something earlier, like, somebody called him to do fake beef because they know that it'll boom up the sales. Everybody know that. You know what I mean? Yeah, and but he, they talk about he fell off, though. Something like Kendrick... Now the baby ain't follow, but something like Kendrick. I don't think so either. Okay. You know the baby ain't follow. They talking about like his music sales, of course. But yeah. as far as his ball work, when you got ball work, you'll be around forever. Like he just did was yeah. fire. <laughs> yeah, you you gonna be around forever. Guys like the baby, it don't matter. He'll have roller coasters, but he'll always be around because he can rap. But Kendrick, is, he don't care about that, bro. He's not here for that. He's not here for us to run to the thing and press like and drop right. a comment. That's not what he makes music for. And you gotta respect. Right. Same with J. J. Cole is the same way, so you gotta respect it. I agree. 